Mr. October may not be in the league anymore, but October baseball is coming. The 2022 marathon of a season is closing fast. Every game counts. We go around the league from last night's best slugfest. Let's get it done. Dilly Sports Delight starts right now. Welcome back. This is Dilly Sports Delight. Dylan Foster on the desk as always. Playoff baseball is around the corner and I am ecstatic about it. With less than a month of regular season baseball, things are hotter in the league than Jimi Hendrix 65 Stratocaster that he literally lit on fire. One of those blazing teams, the Arizona Diamondbacks have won eight of their last 10. Last night, starter Merrill Kelly and the Snakes looked for another win in sunny SoCal against the Padres. Tuesday night in San Diego, Merrill Kelly bottom fifth on the mound, and Jake Cronenworth says so long to that ball, 14th homer of the season. Next up, Ha Song Kim says on Yong to that ball as he takes it out the park, 5-3 now. Bottom nine, down one, Jorge Alfaro is up to bat, and he hasn't had a hit since August 14th, not anymore. Padres score one, and they are booking it around. Padres walk it off in the bottom of the ninth, six to five win. Next up, out to the Rocky Mountains, Brew Crew rocks. Elarus Montero doubles to left in the bottom of the sixth, followed by an Alan Trejo single to center. It's now a four run game. Two on now for Jonathan Daza. Bye bye birdie out to deep center field. Just his second of the year. It's now a 6-5 ball game. The Brew Crew would bring in a new pitcher and Randall Gritchick was up at the plate, but new pitcher, no problem. 6-6 six, six ball game now and it is time for extra inning baseball. Bottom 10, give me Gritchick again. Two on, moonshot, we are going to the moon. Three run shot, Rocky score nine in the final three innings. Walk it off at Coors Field, 10 to seven. For the NL wild card, there's Atlanta and the rest of the field. San Francisco and Arizona have been some of the hotter teams in the league, but still have a lot of catching up to do. Meanwhile, the Phillies and Padres maintain that second and third wild card spot, and Milwaukee is right behind with three games back. Orioles. Blue Jays, one of the oldest rivalries in baseball. 697 matchups featuring players like Cal Ripken Jr., Roberto Alomar, Brooks Robinson, Dave Steed, and dozens more. For game 698, the new kids on the block, no, not Donnie Wahlberg and company. This is not the 80s and 90s anymore, people. The new kids on the block for these teams faced off. Roll the highlights. Out to Baltimore, bottom third, Adley Rutschman, bases loaded. Rutschman, fair ball, left side, tucked it inside the bag. Two run score off of Rutschman's hit. The O's would make it 5-3 before the end of the inning. Bottom eight, now 7-5, Ryan Mountcastle at the dish. Slings one into left field. One run scores, 8-5 ball game. Rutschman booking it around, initially tagged out but he would be called safe as there was a home plate violation. The O's would go on to win the game 9-6. to six. Staying in the AL East, Boston, Tampa, bottom first. Rich Hill gets the call with two men on. Randy Arozarena did his thing for the Rays. 0-2, shot deep down the middle, back into center. Hernandez to the wall. That's gone! Besides destroying the camera, that's his 19th homer of the season and a career-high 74th RBI. Rich Hill, on the other hand, would be pulled after just four innings, allowing five earned runs. Bottom six now, 5-2 Rays. Christian Bethencourt, crack, thank you. 6-2 game now. Next up, Yu Chang, see you later, give me another one. Rays go back to back for the fourth time this season and go on to win the game, eight to four. The American League is closer than ever this season, with the top three seeds all separated by a game and a half. The Blue Jays, though, have arguably the strongest schedule remaining, with 24 of the remaining games being against wildcard contenders, and 16 of those against Baltimore and Tampa Bay. The card for baseball tonight is full. First pitch will be at 1235 Eastern Time. We'll be back on Friday for more sports action. For Dilly Sports Delight, I'm Dylan Foster.